Fighting at Kushidera Temple. Monks are in danger. Norio! Lord Sakai! Look what they've done! Kushidera Temple deserves reverence, not bloodshed. Centuries of wisdom lie within those walls, and the Mongols were ready to torch it all to the ground. They attacked for a reason. The temple gives people hope! The abbot's been telling people to pray for a great storm to wash the invaders from our home. Now the abbot's missing. And the brutes stole the most sacred relic in Toyotama, a statue of Buddha, carved at the temple's founding. My brother would have recovered them. He would have given these monks hope before they ran for the hills. And we honor his memory and restore the temple. The Mongols stole the statue of Buddha from the main hall. And the abbot? He and his closest followers fled. I'm hoping they found shelter. I'll see to the monks. I hope Abbot Kome is safe. The abbot is from Cedar Temple. Why did he come here? to help resist the Mongols in Toyotama. But when they attacked, he escaped. The battle was chaotic. Might be difficult to track them. There's a farm nearby that supports the temple. We'll start there. Into that. And the abbot must have found shelter. This reminds me of another time Abbot Kome went missing. The temple was divided by a feud between our senior monks. What were they fighting about? I don't remember. But it seemed important at the time. The abbot disappeared for a week. We dropped everything to look for him. What happened to him? He hid from us on purpose. And we stopped fighting in order to find him. He's a cunning leader. Another time, my brother and the healer, Hochi, were fighting. The abbot started carrying a rock everywhere, arguing with it night and day. Hochi and Enjo were so embarrassed, they reconciled. How did your brother feel about the abbot? Enjo respected him. The father. If the Mongols capture the abbot, it could work out well for us. 
It sounds like he tricked them into giving up the invasion. <laughs> You're beginning to understand Avakomi. Fire! Coming from the farm. Let's go, Nobu. Did nothing wrong. I can't believe it. My lord, you're too late. Where is the abbot? He was hiding in that house. They burned it to the ground. No, for sure. They were cut down escaping the fire. The abbot's not with them. Check inside. He's dead. Burned alive. Not you. Is it the abbot? Bastards love their fire, don't they? He's not the abbot. Just one of his followers. Keep searching. Water barrels. Tipped over. Straw bedding. Hmm. Damp. Could the abbot have saved himself? Protected himself with wet bedding. Escaped out the back. Maybe he survived. Whoever survived the fire went this way. And there's still hope. <gasps> Footprints are heavier, farther apart. He was running. Blood. He jumped down.
blood on the rocks. Is that a cave? No. Is he? I'm sorry, Ariel. Without his leadership, the monks will leave. And the temple will fall. The Mongols won. What's that next to him? A Lotus Sutra. Written in the abbot's blood. His final act. Like a samurai's death poem. The point of this sutra is that we can all be Buddhas. From the lowest peasant to the greatest noble. Written with his dying breath. Not for himself, but for those he left behind. Show the sutra to the monks. If they see the abbot's devotion, they might stay. And this is the sutra the abbot wrote in his own blood. A final act of devotion. A call to stand up to cruelty. A call to stay and not surrender. We will honor the abbot's sacrifice, Norio. We must not let Kushi Temple fall. Enjo the Guardian saved us once. Now his brother and Lord Sakai have saved us again. And together we can defeat the Mongols. find the statue of Buddha. Why would they take it? The statue was here. Yes, my lord. The Mongols stole our sacred Buddha and rode off toward the coast. We'll return the statue and save this temple. Not even your brother could keep that promise, Norio. What was that about? My brother fell to a Mongol blade. Enjo the Guardian dies, and these monks are willing to give up everything. They're cowards. They're people. Enjo feared nothing. He wasn't even 20 when he saved this temple from bandits. Now it's up to us. Find the Buddha and return it to the temple. The monks said they took it toward the coast. We can pick up their trail. You're angry. How can you tell? You're not talking. Ah, it's that monk. He doesn't know the whole story about my brother saving Kushidara. I heard Enjo acted alone. That's the legend. In reality, he ordered three of his bravest monks to challenge the bandits. A distraction. A sacrifice. They died in battle, but only after giving Enjo enough time to flank the bandits and save the temple. My lord, over there. So. I was following the Mongols and begged them to give back our Buddha. Where did they go? Out of the forest. To the hills. May your next life be more peaceful than this one. 
He gave his life for his temple. Like my brother. You will do the same. A Mongol camp. The statue must be there. First, we punish them for attacking the temple. Statue. from a star that fell from the heavens centuries ago. Beautiful. There's nothing else like it on the island. Let's get it back to the temple. Angel became the guardian when bandits attacked the temple. They came for this statue. It's priceless. Probably survived many such attempts. How many more people have to die protecting it? You want to let it be stolen? No. But the temple is filled with treasures. It provokes greed and envy. Lord Shimura brought me to see it when I was a boy. I was sure the sculptor must have met the Buddha in person. When I was a boy, my family traveled here to make an offering for the new year. That's when Enjo and I decided to become monks. I used to know what I fought for. We fight for a home. Maybe so. Have you spoken with the monks? Their resolve is growing, but they still fear the Mongols. As they should. 
Where is everyone? At the river. Bathing. Washing clothes. Who's that coming to the temple? Look. A Mongol who wants to die. He's alone. See what he wants first. The ghost. And the brother of the guardian. I have a message for you. Speak. The ghost and the monks have defied the Khan's will. Surrender, and we spare this place. Refuse, and all will burn. We will never surrender. Then you will die. don't have time to reach shelter. Then we'll be their shelter. Oh, I can't. The Buddha, the Abbot Sutra. Are they worth more than the monks' lives? I can't save them alone. Centuries of learning reside in this temple. I can't let it burn. But you'll let the monks burn. I will die for this temple. Do what you have to. Then stay here. I'll find the monks at the river and bring them back. Mongols coming! Get away from the river! Norio, what are you doing? The temple's undefended. Temples can be rebuilt. Lives can't. We'll defend the monks at the pagoda. Lead the way! All of you, come with us!
Mongols lost badly here. They won't be eager to return. The monks will never forget what you did for them. I didn't fight alone, Norio. No, but if I had not listened to you, many more would be dead. What will you do now? It's time I return to see the temple. We still need your Naginata to drive the invaders from our home. You'll have it. And my temple will be a strong ally to you in the north. I'll join you there. Let's check the temple grounds. The Buddha. My brother earned the name Guardian when he saved this temple. I wish we could have saved the statue. The statue's final lesson. Save what we can, but know that everything passes away. It's a worse statue when it's broken, but a better teacher.
Lord Sakai! Genji, what are you doing? You have stumbled on a perfect opportunity, my lord. Down this road lies an enemy camp stuffed with supplies to feed, clothe, and heal dozens, hundreds, and the Mongols left! <laughs> it's a ripe plum just begging for it! What are you not telling me? This is a simple situation. No Mongols, lots of stuff. Help ourselves, help the people. <sighs> On the slim chance some good comes of this. Lead the way. I knew you'd understand, Lord Sakai. How did you find this camp? I've been following these guys for a while. They're so arrogant, they leave their camp unguarded when they go on raids. Then who are you waiting for on the road? Who, who me? Uh, uh, nobody. Oh, I was on my way to the camp when you happened by. There are survivors taking refuge near the Yarikawa stronghold. They need supplies. That's exactly the people I'm trying to help. What did I tell you? So beautiful it makes you weep. Look around. Gather what you can. Plenty of food here. Fish, vegetables, rice, and millet. Japanese, not Mongolian. They're learning to like our cuisine. The man who's going to end Kenji's life. You left me here to die. No, not true. I brought help. Meet Lord Sakai. Also known as the ghost. One of you explain what's happening. Now. Kenji set me up is what's happening. It wasn't a setup. The Mongols were supposed to pay for this stuff. Only they didn't. And then they took my friend Nato here hostage. They were supposed to pay for this? Hear that? They're back! Please, cut me loose! Where did you get these supplies? We stole them from Straw Hats. <sighs> Lord Sakai, can you distract the Mongols? So you can escape? Not exactly. I have an idea. Trust me. No more ideas, Kenji. Just take your friend and go. Kenji! 
Kenji's friend. You can come out now. It's safe. Over here! We are locked in! Lord Saka! We thought it would be safer in here. But then it locked. Thank you, Lord Sakai. Yes, thank you! You know what happens now. <laughs> I'm going to ride that Sakai barrel all the way to... Kenji, I think he's angry. Lord Sakai, our intention was always to gift our gains to the survivors who need it most. The camp outside the town of Yarikawa. Gather everything you can. And when I visit that camp, I'm going to find it overflowing with food and medicine, correct? Yes, my lord. Yes, my lord. I told you this was a bad idea. What's bad? It worked out perfectly. There's no way he did. Come, see what I can make for you, my lord. Worthy of a samurai. Boy, you're f was there at the exact moment Jin Sakai took Castle Canada by himself? Not the exact moment, but... 